Four weeks of hard work. One, thank you for storing this in the middle of winter. Hey. In one of the coolest garages there is. Are you excited? I'm excited. It's still new. It's still so new. It's sometimes hard to believe I actually have it. Because it literally came from the factory straight to you guys. Oh. It's like Christmas all over again. Best looking stormtrooper there is. <laughs> yeah. So guys, for you, what was the hardest part of this process on this vehicle? Because everyone I know presents their own unique challenges. The hood, yeah. Yeah, doing the hood one piece. So there are no seams on that hood. Just one big piece. You have where we cut here, obviously. So there's the ledge right inside of here. Other than that, that's one that's yeah. one smooth piece. <laughs> Thank you for helping protect. It's an investment, and a lot of people might think I'm crazy, but this is going to go out and be a regular attendant at I-29, Ottawa Dragway, um, Motorsports Park Hastings. Going to uh, hopefully have it down to Topeka. Oh, for yeah. the season opener of streetcar takeover and it's not a, maybe not a lot of street in this car but we'll try and put a little street back into it i just want to go for a ride at some point whether oh. it's on a roll race event or something oh 100 percent. oh we forgot the part oh green's my thing just what about every way back when when i started my trucking company the turbo turtle, the man himself, is a green turtle. Yeah. So since then, green has always had a special place in my heart. And we were looking for a way to make this car pop out just a little bit without being obscene. And also protecting the bars from getting scratched as I crawled in and others crawled in and over. And that is the perfect color pop. It does. That that's pretty incredible. That's yeah. That's those are the kind of little details that help to set this apart from. Yes, there's only 60 of these, but you know each one is as unique as its owner. Thankfully, GM let us put you know touches like this was supposed to have a white hood with black lettering, and I was like, nah, gotta. Oh, they, they actually know. called me three times. Are you sure you want a black hood? I'm like, yes. Black hood, white letters, a little contrast. That's such a good call. So thank you, gentlemen, for your hard work. Thank you for protecting this investment. Oh, yeah. This is it's a lot of fun. one of the things that's unique about your company is just the way you guys take your wrap down to each edge, beyond. And thank you for correcting the graphics on the other side <laughs> yeah. by the fuel filler door. That was. Hopefully, we were able to get the stickers. Yes. That was something. We were that shows a level of dedication on your guys' part that I don't think anyone else would have gone to those lengths. And that really makes you guys stand out from the crowd. Does Freedom Tint have stickers? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they can give you some. Does JS Detailing have stickers? Of course. Black and white. But we're not gonna put them on without your permission. So if you want us to put them on, now's the time because everything. Actually, how like how big how big is the JS detailing a, one? We got two sizes. Yeah. One's like a three-inch one and then a small one. There's a big and then there's a little. I don't know if you want them in a certain area. One on each side or. What do you think about right? I, I, like one on each side right there. Yeah. That would look. Com what does yours look like? Well, okay. You got long arms. <laughs> Pull Cent in the back. Center this one right in the back yeah. and put one of these on either side in the little windows. Oh, okay. You can do that.
I almost want to see how Joel gets in this. Lights, camera, action. Let the fuel pump prime for a moment. <laughs> oh, that's a bit. Okay. We got we gotta flip this back. Oh. Give the whole... Oh, they get hyped. Uh -oh.